Hello and thank you for watching my online lesson on calculating the percentage change. So these questions are where they tell you a starting amount and an ending amount and they ask you to work out what was the percentage increase or decrease. This question here says, Bytes is a shop that sells computers and digital cameras. In 2003, Bytes sold 620 computers. In 2004, Bytes sold 708 computers. Work out the percentage increase in the number of computers sold and give your answer to an appropriate degree of accuracy. This is a format question and it's quite a simple process. There's just a formula that you need to remember that you can use every time. So the first thing I'm going to do is as I'm working out the percentage change, the first thing I need to find is what was the actual amount change. So I'm going to do 708 take away 620 and that's 88. So I know that from 2003 to 2004 they sold 88 more computers. So now I need to find out what is this 88 as a percentage of the starting amount. So I'm trying to find what was 88 out of the 620 as a percentage. So I've got a fraction there already. To turn that into a percentage, I simply multiply by 100. So the formula that I'm using every time is to do my change divided by my original, my starting amount, and then multiply by 100. So if I type this in my calculator, I get 14.19 and lots of decimal points. So to a suitable degree of accuracy, one decimal place will be fine. So 14.2% is my answer. If this question had been a percentage decrease question instead, the process would have been exactly the same. I'd have worked out what the change was and make sure I divide that by the original starting amount, which this time in a decrease question would be the bigger of the two numbers and then multiply by 100. Now once I've got my answer, there is actually a way I can check I've done it right. I'm saying that from 620 computers in 2003, it increased by 14.2% to get to the 708. So if I work out what 14.2% of 620 is and add this on, I should get roughly 708. I might not get it exactly because I did round my answer. So let's work it out. Now, I'm going to use a multiplier here. This is the easiest way to do it. I'm going to take my 620 and multiply by, and if I want a 14.2% increase, well, 14.2% increase, I'll add the 100% that I start with. So that's 114.2%. To write that as a decimal, that's 1.142. So I multiply by 1.142. Two. You can do it a different way. You can divide the 620 by 100 and then times by 14.2 and then add that back on. But this is probably the quickest way if you're comfortable using multipliers. And when I type this in my calculator, I actually get 708.04. So near enough exactly the amount in 2004. So I know I've done this right. It is slightly out and that's because I rounded my answer. So here's a question for you to try. Um, it's about the population of a European community and it is a percentage increase question as well. And it wants you to give your answer to one decimal place. If you pause the video now, the full word solution will come up when you unpause the video. Here's the solution. So you should have got that the change was 75 million. So I do 75 divided by the starting amount, which is 376, and times by 100. So on my calculator, to one decimal place, the answer is 19.9%. Thank you for watching.